Welcome to Camp Conversations. I'm CNHI Colts B writer George Bremer, and our guest today is former Lafayette Central Catholic and Purdue star Danny Anthrop. Danny, thanks for joining us. Thank you for having me. Danny, you get your first pro shot in your home state of Indiana. What's that opportunity meant to you? That's huge. You know, uh, you got to take advantage of every time uh, you step on the field, every time they give you a rep. Uh, you know, I feel like uh, all the young receivers, you know, kind of have the same mindset of going out there and try to make as big of an impact as they can. I know there's no game planning or, or anything sort of like that going into the first preseason game, but does this week have a little bit of different feel to it, knowing that you're a few days away from that first uh, exhibition game? Oh, yeah. I think especially more so for the young guys because I think we're going to get, uh, you know, s some good opportunities in that game. And, uh, you know, it's our first time lining up against another guy uh, in the NFL. How excited are you personally for that game? And not only is it your first NFL game, it's at the Hall of Fame in Canton, Ohio, against the Green Bay Packers. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm ecstatic and I'm really excited about it. Uh, you know, I can't wait to get there and, and you know, kind of see what that's like. Uh, but, you know, you got to remain focused on uh, your job and what you have to do. So, you know, it's just another kind of business trip for you. We will take a quick break for a word from our sponsor, and we'll be right back with more with Danny Anthrop. Welcome back here to Colts Camp. We were talking a little about the excitement this week uh, with the game coming up. What uh, the guys that have been there before, the T.Y. Hiltons, the Dante Moncriefs, how much have they meant to you in meeting rooms and in practices as you've gone through this process through the spring and now the early part of training camp? Uh, you know, those are the guys that uh, you know I've been playing the game for a while, and uh, you know you're foolish if you don't learn from them and you know kind of see what they do and uh, you know the rest that you're going to be running. Uh, you know, there's a lot to learn from, from T.Y. and Kreef and Phillip. Uh, you know, I, I really am thankful for, you know, just being able to be around them and, you know, see how they approach the game and how they play. Coach said earlier today, Coach Pagano, early in camp it's not hard to get everybody excited because it's new and everything's fresh. This is day six. Sometimes things start to get bogged down a little bit. But the night practice tonight, does that provide a little more energy, a little more excitement? No, I think so, absolutely. Uh, you know, I feel like it's a good opportunity for fans to come out and, uh, you know, because a lot of people will be off work. Uh, off work. Uh, you know, I think it's going to be a good one for everybody. It's a little bit of a change up. Maybe it won't be so hot. Uh, you know, it hasn't really bothered us too much in camp. But, uh, you know, I think another big, uh, you know, kind of motivator is that we have a day off tomorrow. Mm -hmm. So people can go a little bit longer, a little bit harder. You mentioned fans. Obviously, Lafayette's not too far away. You have any friends or family drop by so far or expect them to be able to? I've had my family come by, uh, you know, they've been here twice, I believe. They might come tonight, I'm not sure if, they, if they're going to make it, but, uh, you know, it's been cool to, you know, kind of stay local. Uh, one last question for you. What's your goal now? You, you've got one more week here in camp, and then you've got five preseason games. What's the goal by the end of the preseason for you? You know, uh, my goal is to take advantage of every opportunity I have and, you know, control what I can control and, and really stay focused. Uh, you know, if I do that, I think everything's going to take care of itself. All right, thanks a lot for joining us. Thank you. Good luck. Thank you. 